today I was gonna start a new project, but we got a little um, waylaid today because I got a little sicky at home. Oh, hi Cole. Are you recording? I am, how are you feeling, baby? <laughs> I am her editor. He's my editor. Isn't he the cutest little editor ever? But yeah, he came home sick today. So, anyway. Alright, I'm going to show them. I'm going to do an easier project today because I've got to make sure I can come in here and take care of you. Are you feeling okay? Yeah. Okay. So, I've decided to do, there was actually a small project that I have going on. Um, I haven't done it yet. I've been putting it off and I don't know why. It's so funny. I keep thinking I'm going to hire somebody to do it and then I'm like, I could do it, right? So see, oops, it just wants to focus on my face because I'm so pretty. Um, okay, so, so the wires just hang out here, right? Now there's actually an outlet through here, in, way in the back of the wall. But what happens is when I plug it in there, because I can stick my skinny arm through there, I can. Um, but when I plug it in there, um, then the wires will get caught over here on the side and then the door don't close, and that's super annoying. So uh, I'm gonna try and drill a nice party round hole right here. Now that actually requires me taking the store out, which I have to figure out how to do that, and then um, and then getting my draw, my drill, and, um, and just drilling a perfect hole, which I've actually never drilled one of those, like those really big round, big ones, you know what I mean, like that big, because it has to be big enough to get um, the cord through it, right? because I got this cord that's gonna get through there, but then I also got this cord that's gonna have to get through that hole. So I'm gonna have to drill a hole big enough to, to squeeze this sucker through. So that's my, um, my agenda today. Okay. So I just wanna show you guys, this is what I'm talking about. So see in the back there, there's actually a outlet right there. You see it? So I got my so. drawer out here. And then um, I was looking at my drill bits, and that is questionable because, so these are the kind of um, drill bits that you need to make a hole, right? And I don't know if either of these, these are my biggest ones. So this is the cord that has to go through here. And yeah, these aren't big enough. So I think I am gonna have to make another run to my local Crown Ace hardware store and um, get a bigger one of these doodads. All right. Oh, you're back. There's a lot of drill bits to look at. Holy Hades. Because I want the one with either a flat, like the flat one like I showed you, or there's one that's like a cup kind of that you can get. But this is a lot. I might need some help. I need Not help. Too bad. I need help. Of course. You're in you're front. Say hi. Hi. I'm feeling this. Ace is the place with the helpful <laughs> hardware man. Um, I need to make a large hole in something. So I need either the flat drill bit or the one that's like a cup okay, thingy. I'm thinking that's what I'm thinking. How big do you think? I need like inch and a half or inch and three quarters. Uh, what are we going through? Um... Metal? Wood. Uh, no, wood. Wood? Wood. Inch and a half? Yeah. Do I want that or do I want one of these? What's the difference? Both will generally do good. It's just kind of, that's going to be a bit more of a bore. That's going to be more of just a general circle. But, you know, I might get them both just for hoots and hollers yeah, just, and just see which one I like better. Yeah. So one weird. and a half. Okay. All right. Perfect. Ace is the place with the hell of a hardware, <laughs> man. We tried. Trying. I'm gonna do like a little practice test run because uh, I got the the drill bit that looks like it is a cup, and then I also got um, this flat one. Okay, and I they kind of do the same thing, but I'm not really sure what the main difference is. So I just want to do a little test run before I ruin a piece of furniture. So I have this little piece of one by that I have clamped down. Ooh, hopefully that stays. And I'm gonna give this one a try first, okay? Now, between you and me, I'm not really even sure I have it in here correctly. <laughs> Shh. Um, but it looks like it's gonna work, so, I don't know. I mean, come on. What could, what could really happen here? Okay, so let's see if I can get this sucker to work. Ooh, a sucker. 
have her grips, doesn't it? All right, let's see. So now I got um, this drill bit, the flat one. So, all right, we're gonna see what magic can happen here. Let's see. All right, I'm gonna go slow. So of those two, this was the one that looks like a little cuppy doo-doo. And this was the other one. And I'm quite sure I'm doing something wrong. Um, I'm not really sure. But um, but yeah, it didn't quite go all the way through and it kind of kept getting stuck. And then it also, if you're clumsy like I am, it bit into my wood a lot. Um, so I'm gonna opt for the cuppy doo-doo. So all right, now I'm gonna put it, do it to my actual drawer. So let's hope that I don't mess it up. Okay, so um, so I got my drawer here. Here's my drawer. Rather than taking the drawer handle off, I'm actually just placing it between the corners here of my uh, workbench. And then I got my stool. So hopefully I can get enough height so I get enough leverage. I'm gonna try and put the hole right here. And that's it, fingers crossed, all right? Bam! Okay, so that actually was okay. Um, I drilled a hole. Bam! So now I'm just gonna get my um, the cord that has to go through there and make sure it fits because it's gonna be tight because that cord was right at an inch and a half and so is this hole. Okay, problem number 364. I can't get the drill bit off now. Sweet Jesus, it's like stuck on there. Why? Oh my God. Seriously. I'm gonna have to buy another drill. Sweet mother of God. See, I need to come out with a line of stuff that's meant for people who aren't horribly strong. Right? I mean, that sucker is on. <laughs> I hope I only ever need to use this piece for the rest of my life. I'm gonna have to buy a new drill. I can't get this shit off. Oh my. <sighs> okay, let's see if this sucker fits. a dodo head you know what I didn't take into account that's not just this thing it's I have to get the teeth or the, whatever those things pull the prongs through there too <laughs> shoot I'm gonna have to make it a lot bigger all right I'm gonna try and widen that hole with that other piece It's gonna have to wait. Okay, so here we are. I have my dresser, I mean my tape, my <coughs> drawer with the handy dandy hole, and I hope I did it right. So now I'm gonna try and put it back in, which actually can sometimes be the hardest part. So we'll see. Here we go. Back in. So now I've got to try and thread the plugs through the hole 
and plug it into the back of the wall, which is easier said than done because there's like no room. I don't know when they designed this, what the guy was thinking, because you can really get any arm back through here. So here we go. Okay. Thank God I am pliable.